This is a must win, okay? So again, if Odie wins, is it James and him cut that margin under 100. So that's why it's gonna come down to Irwindale. If James Dean wins, he is your 2024 Formula Drift champion. Odie Bakshis, James Dean, leaving the start line. The championship is up for grabs. And it's between these two gentlemen. Odie Bakshis, let's send it! James Dean comes in, chasing him down to that first outside zone. Now transitioning into the second outside zone. Odie Bakshis, good composure. James Dean right there, maybe giving a little bit of inch. And here comes Odie Bakshis in that second outside zone, transitioning into that final outside zone. James Dean, he wants it. He goes into the dirt. He drops tire. Odie, Odie Bakshis. Keeps the composure, the feel suspension, keeping them rock, rock solid. Oh, all right, let's take a look and see what we can pull from this run. So Odie Box, she's going nice and wide. James Dean mirroring him at initiation. Odie gets into that zone super early, rides the edge of the first outside zone. James Dean just waiting. Odie Box, she's floating out to that second outside zone, gets back on throttle. James Dean right there in the pocket, in the zone, mirroring, o mirroring Odie Box, she's the entire way through that second outside zone, third outside zone. Now, Odie Box, she's pushing real hard. James Dean getting there and just dives at the very last second, but both drivers almost completely perfect to that entire run. I mean, there's there's almost nothing to critique here anymore. I, I, I just, I don't even want to. Yeah. I don't need to. Look at, look at outside zone two. Outside zone three, James does make that tire drop. Watch this. So uh, again, outside zone three, he wavers. And a little bit of tire drop from James Dean. Oh, jeez, though. And right at the end, just pushes in and just yep. to like show that at any moment he could basically be running door to door with Odie Bach. It was just like a little point proven. Hey, look what I can do. Yep, knock it, knock it on his door. Give yeah. him a little, again, a little tap. There's the RTR camp watching on. Technicians, mechanics, Ben Hobson, his RTR teammate. Will it be decided here in Utah? The fate is truly in Odie Bakshis' hands. He, he could put a stop to this and push it to Irwindale. But now, James Dean, let's send it here in Utah. Do we have a 2024 champion in James the Machine Dean? Or is it Odie Box? She's going to put a stop to it. Again, it's championship or push. James Dean goes to that first outside zone, transition to outside zone two. Odie Box, she's, now he makes his presence felt. Oh, look at him, angle for angle. James Dean dips a tire. One, two. Trucks are flapping. It's championship or push. Odie Box, she's gets thrown off. James Dean, massive angle. Odie Box, she's riding shotgun in that right hand drive. Ford Mustang. Are you kidding me? Did you breathe, Jacob? I am now. Woo! I am yes, now. sir. Oh, doctor. Look at James Dean. He knows Odie Boxes is right there. Championship or push. He holds the feet. Odie in the pocket, so it's going to come down to this second outside zone. Who is at fault? What happened here? Because it does look like James Dean might have come out of the zone and then add more angle to get back in again. Let's see. Be a little Odie shallow there. But James came out, as you said. Yeah. So both of them kind of bobbling. But no contact there. No, it, no it, contact there. It looked like they might have touched uh, when James was starting to push out of the zone. Odie was in the pocket and, tr and tries to come out a bit with him. But yeah, I think we're, we're gonna have to see it. Right, we're gonna have to it's, see this a few times. But look at this first outside zone. That's just nailed it. Beauty. So James, good angle there. Odie dives in the inside. So James adds angle. I don't. I don't, I don't, don't think even know if they touch. I don't think they touched on the on the front oh, wheels. So hard to say. Odie, Odie was shallow, and that that could have hurt him. But James went deeper in that second outside zone yeah. and got into and, and you know and Odie. That's it's almost like well, I don't want to say Dylan what Dylan did to James, but that's where the contact was made. Yeah. Um, it, it, James by no means floated. He was on throttle yeah. all the way, but uh, but dove in some wavering. Both of them are shallow in that second outside zone. So again, the scenario is. If Odie wins, it goes to Irwindale. If James Dean wins, he is your 2024 champion, and Odie, Odie Bakshi gets the win. Odie Bakshi wow. gets the win. Beecham is guaranteed his first ever Formula Drift podium. Congratulations to him. And guys, here we go. Trent Beecham, Frederick Osmo. Beecham out of the gate comes out swinging. He knows he can take down the uh, a three time champ. Here we go. Beecham in that first outside. Zone. Look at him using all of the course. He is possessed. Oh, no. oh Beecham, what do we got? I think we got okay. a, we got a TV. In that, second, in that second outside zone. Now coming into that last outside zone, Frederick Osbo brings it right there. And look at Freddie banging on the door and across that finish line. 
you're, so, you're, that back right? You're, yeah, I think, I, I think there, I'm almost positive there is a DB there, and I'm, uh, exactly, it, it's yeah, possible it's, too. Osbo got in real tight on initiation. Yeah, that's that. the first time. If I Osbo, like that, you know, I try cracked to the side of that car, I mean, we could be looking at a pretty interesting situation here, but we'll watch back from our airforce.com replay. So Beecham really on it right away. And then comes over the rumble strips. And then we see. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, man. No. Oh. And that's where we saw it yesterday in Prospec. You know, as, as the track changes, that's where we saw a couple D-beats. And that could hurt Trenton Beecham's efforts of going to the finals. Yeah. Let's see if we can see it happening. Yeah, as he comes across that rumble strip. That's what does it. Yep. So. Oh, yeah. yeah it's a Man, how he powered through that is pretty impressive. That's pretty, but, uh, you know, pretty that, sick, yeah. And that's, you know, you saw Freddy just jump to the side of him. So crazy, man. Yeah, man. I mean, huge kudos to, to Beecham to, to power through the rest of that run. We've seen a couple of drivers do that before. But, yeah, rear, rear the tire DB rules. Rear tires are required to make two consecutive runs. The tire may be changed in a comp timeout only allowed if a DB is due to contact. So uh, if changed, both competitors may change their tires. So if Osbo obviously like hit him and caused it to DB, that is one thing. Uh, if it DB did completely independent, that is a, uh, a, an entirely other situation. Not what we want to see here. I mean, no. we've seen a few DBs, but ultimately it's been, it's been pretty good. Um, definitely events with far more than what we're seeing here. Yeah, and, and we saw a few of them in Prospect, but look at that. Oh, man. Oh, look at look at Freddie giving him his I applause. Know. You know, Beecham, you know, obviously we want to see him do battle to Osbo. He's taking him down, but with that D bead, and again, the judges, was there contact? Was there contact between Osbo? There was no contact. So that unfortunately is. Trenton Beecham D-beating under, you know, no contact, so you cannot replace it. Frederick Osbo gets the win. This is his by run. The car is running. It's Osbo and Bakshis in the finals. The Rockstar Energy Drink Toyota GR Supra is getting on the box once again. He got the win in Atlanta, and uh, a great audience there, a great track. And, uh, you know, you got to think, Shanahan, we saw, uh, we saw that of James Dean a few times. We saw Ryan Turk. Odie has not received a victory. And again, we are taking a look here. And with that, Osbo goes to third place right. above Manoa, correct? All right. So, look, uh, again, with that, so the man currently still in first is with Lorette Nickel, James the Machine Dean. Why does he have that smile on his face still? He just able to get this nailed and able to do it time and time again. And that's what has brought him to this point. And Frederick Osbo going back to almost his robotic ways of, of understanding what the track is like, understanding what he needs to do and putting it exactly where it needs to be on lap after lap. So two drivers, top of their game, driving with perfection, head to head in the finals. That's what we're here. Here's your popcorn, send it! Here we go. Frederick Osbo chasing down Odie Bakshi's in that first outside zone. These are the finals here in Utah. The Type S elevated. Round seven, and the championship's coming down to Irwindale. Odie Bakshi's, like you said, perfection. Frederick Osbo, he brings it in. He's looking tight. That last outside zone. The cars are wound up, and there it is. Odie Bakshi's once again. I mean, I feel like it's an RC car. He is on rails. There's magnets on the track, and he's got magnets underneath his car. He's just stuck to it like glue. The power of Lithuania is with them. There's many Lithuanians. There they are. This man needs to be studied. It's going to be needed to take Odie out, but, man, this is, this is wild. This is so much fun, man, and, and this is just why I love Formula Drift. I'm so proud of, of where drifting has you know, where it came from and where it's at and where it's going. 2004, yeah. four rounds, the progression of Hachirokus and S13s and, and, and even Dodge Vipers to now, you know, Toyota making a commitment, Ford making a commitment, many manufacturers making a commitment, tire manufacturers. And here it is, let's send it for potentially the last time here in Utah. Frederick, the Norwegian Hammer Osbo, the rock star energy drink Toyota GR Supra. Oh, knocks the bumper off of Odie Box's S chassis. Freddy, he's got that special sauce. Let's see if he can pour it on the brisket. Brisket box cheese, right? He got that smoked meat into that second outside zone. Odie Box cheese has been perfection. He showed a little bit of a little bit of glimmer, a little bit of opportunity for Frederick Osbo. Diving in. Woo-wee! 
Oh, wow. Another interesting one. How you decide that? That's that we are we are splitting hairs here. We are burning treads. So taking a look now with our side by side. I mean both drivers doing a pretty decent job through the first outside zone. Odie might have been a little bit deeper through there, but Odie also did have that contact in the chase now. Our second outside zone, it looks like Osmo is on a bit better of a line, but Odie's got a bit better proximity. Final zone, can we find any difference here? But not really, both drivers keeping it pretty tight. I mean, Odie was slightly tighter on the chase, but Osmo might have had a bit better of a line. Your winner here at round seven of the Formula Drift Pro Championship, Type S, elevated, and the driver that elevated and gets the win is unanimously Odie Bakshi gets the win! Yeah!